Assalamu alaikum, hello and welcome to uh, this video. I would like to start this video by apologizing to all uh, who watch Arabic Global videos, my videos. I'm so sorry it took me so long to upload a new video, but I'm, I've been uh, pretty busy with my thesis and you know, it takes time. <laughs> so wish me luck and make dua for me uh, that inshallah I'll be done soon so I'll be back soon with full energy. <laughs> Um, this video, as the title says, is about a free Arabic course, a 100% free Arabic course. I've been wanting to do this uh, for a long time, but you know, since my thesis came, I thought, why don't I kind of use that, make an, a free Arabic course and, and use that for my thesis? So this would be a description for this free Arabic course. If you want to take part in that free Arabic course, watch this video till, till the end and you will know what exactly you need to do to take part in this course. First of all, this course will be about reading and creating comics. In Arabic, of course. <laughs> so we will read Arabic comics and also we will create uh, uh, comics. Uh, the course inshallah will start in May. It's not going to start right now. It will start inshallah in May. It will take uh, from six to eight, tentatively, like from six to eight weeks. So if that time does not work for you, then maybe you should not apply. So bear in mind that it's, it will start in May and it will take from six to eight weeks. Um, it will involve some group activities. You will have fun. Just let me say that. You will have fun <laughs> and also learn. Um, so as I said, it will involve uh, reading comics and creating comics, group activities. It, uh, it will start in May. It's a, a totally free course. Bear in mind for those of you, uh, you know, who are watching and they are new to this, this is an online course. We will meet online. How? I will tell you exactly how uh, when, when you are chosen for that uh, course, but it's an online course. We do not meet offline. It's an online course. Um, so you meet with me, basically, and some other students. Okay, uh, some of you might be asking, is it for modern standard Arabic? Is it for Egyptian Arabic? Actually, for both. <laughs> so you, if you uh, wanting to learn modern standard Arabic, apply. If you want to learn Egyptian Arabic, apply. And then the, you know, the biggest group or the, the group that fits the, the, the characteristics or the specifications that I've put, uh, these are the ones that we will stick with. But, um, you have to know that this is part of my thesis project. So you'll be required to answer uh, questionnaires, uh, you know, conduct an interview with me, know that the things that you're gonna write, I'm gonna include it in my thesis as well. Uh, I mean, the comics that you're gonna create, it's gonna be part of my thesis, inshallah. Um, you will have to sign a consent form at the beginning of uh, the experiment to say, okay, you know, I'm totally in, I'll be committed to this and I am okay with the, with the, with my stuff to be used in your thesis and stuff like that. So just, just to tell me that's okay in an official, <laughs> in an official manner. Um, now, not everyone that is going to be, to apply is going to be selected. Uh, it, it's going to be around 20 students. Okay. So apply as soon as possible. So, because I, I'm going to kind of close that once I have these 20 students that fit uh, this specification that I put. Um, okay. Now, unfortunately, this course is not for absolute beginners. As I said, it involves reading comics and creating comics. That means you already have a knowledge in Arabic. A small note. <laughs> so you're able to read and write, meaning you recognize the letters, if you see a word you read it. And the level that is required for this course is high elementary and above. What do I mean by that? I mean that you're able to speak or write about simple, simple social uh, kind of interactions. For instance, you're able to introduce yourself, you're able to talk about your family, you're able to talk about your hobbies or um, you know, just, you know, where you're living, where you work, just this simple, simple social kind of uh, interaction, simple information about yourself, not necessarily fluent, not necessarily perfect. So it, I do not mean 
that you're able to do it 100 percent but at least you have the kind of competency sort of you're able to do that you've kind of studied that before so this is what i mean by this level above that level are welcomed to uh, participate below if you're an absolute beginner or you still are not familiar with the alphabet or you don't know um, how to introduce yourself or talk about your family or these kind of social things small small social things then maybe this is not the right course for you it's it's not for absolute beginners i have to stress that <laughs> Uh, it's for high elementary and above, those who are able to write or uh, uh, speak about these uh, small social interactions um, even if it's non, in, in a non-fluent way. طيب. Is that clear? <laughs> okay, طيب. uh, you must be committed. Once you enrolled in that course and, and uh, you're chosen for that course, you have to commit to all the classes so you should not drop the course so if you feel like this timeline is not suitable for me this is not the right course for you because you have to be attending all of the classes doing all of the, the necessary work if you're not committed you're not going to make use of this course you have to be committed i'm giving this as a change for those who are committed students and maybe they cannot afford online classes so Go ahead. If you're committed, apply because that that you will make use of this um, uh, of this course. Um, so knowing that you have to be committed, knowing that that you will take part part you will uh, your participation will be considered in in my thesis project. Uh, knowing that that you have to be uh, sort of high elementary and above. I already discussed discussed that you're not an absolute beginner. Um, Yani above that level are welcome to apply. Do apply guys, it's not a problem. Like, what do I need to do to take part in this course? Three simple steps. First, you are going to uh, fill in the application that is in the link below or in that link that I provided this video. So it will be in the description box on YouTube or uh, on Facebook or social media, it will be on the above. So you have to apply, uh, you have to fill in this application. The application will contain some personal information about you, like your name, email, blah, 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 stuff like that. It will include some information about your background in Arabic. Uh, the most important thing that you need to do is two things. Record a video, that will be in the application. You have to record the video. I ask you to record the video talking in Arabic about in the Arabic variety that you're familiar with, whether uh, Egyptian Arabic or modern standard Arabic, or even if you want to do both, you want to talk a little bit about some topics that I've suggested. Uh, also, you want to write uh, a text about some topics that I uh, suggested. So you're going to basically talk about yourself and stuff like that in, uh, in Arabic. Um, you will see the details in the application. طيب. This is the first thing. So the first thing that I need to apply. The second thing, the second, the second thing, <laughs> the second thing is that you need to uh, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you have not already. Uh, like my Facebook page. The link will be below. And also um, <clears throat> sign up to my website, arabicglobal.com. The reason is I need you to do this is because if I posted a follow-up video or something related to uh, this course you will be kind of uh, updated with that okay and the third the third uh, thing is that you need to share it with your friends you must share it with your friends please share it with your friends okay share it with your friends share in groups that are uh, or people that are interested in that kind of um, you you know that they will be interested you are a university student okay share it with your classmates or your teacher and see yani share it with those people share it with others uh, or those people who will be interested in that type uh, how do you know uh, that you will be accepted once you will accept it inshallah i'll send you uh, an email and then i will also let you know about the details of the specifications of the course so we know inshallah it will start in may but at what time exactly uh, then that will be decided based on the in your application guys um, 
I'll let you know exactly once you are accepted. Uh, we'll just have you know a kind of friendly talk at the beginning, and then we will start inshallah uh, after that. Um, you will sign your consent form, and then we're ready to start. <laughs> okay, so let me know if you have any questions. I'm not sure if I mentioned or not. Uh, maybe uh, that the course again will start in May. Uh, it will be three hours a week. Yeah, yeah, three hours or above, but three hours is the is kind of the middle way, right? So it will be three hours, six to eight weeks. Um, right. Let me know if you have any questions. Comment below if you have any questions or comments in general. Uh, do not forget to apply. Do not forget to share it with your friends. Do not forget to sign up and like and like my Facebook page and sign up to my website and subscribe to my YouTube channel. If you have any questions, do let me know. Yeah, and take that chance and attend this free course. I'll be happy to have you, inshallah, as long as you're committed and you're going to do the work. Inshallah, we'll make use of that course. I'll see you guys next time, inshallah. Ma